Hello, everybody, and welcome back. My name is Jordan. My name's Matt. And today we have a very special guest, Sam, also known as Ninja Spaghetti. <laughs> How are you today? I'm doing well. How are you guys? Good. And you are a banjo speedrunner, right? <laughs> I am. I'm an aspiring banjo speedrunner. I'm definitely not anywhere near the top line yet, but I'm working uh, on it. I would My say... My best time is three and a half hours. You're being quite humble because I watched your streams and you are pretty dang good. So. <laughs> well, definitely, thank you. Yeah, definitely better than what I have going on here. <laughs> I got dibs. I'm reading. I'm reading Gruntilda's lines. I got dibs. Okay. <laughs> Welcome all, Grunty's the name. Banjo's here to play my game. My lair is done, and here he stands. Through all my tricks and traps and lands. This final test will see me win. When Banjo fails, then I'll be thin. The prize on this stand brings joy, bring joy. From 2D down to cuddly toy. My little quiz will make you sweat. And 2D you shall never get. Cause somewhere soon, all along, along the way, your lack of skill will make my day. Cause in the fiery pit you'll go. And I will win the prize on show. So step on over to the square. Press A to try, if you dare. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> I love that piece of dialogue right there. That's like my favorite line in the entire game. That was definitely better than my grunty. <laughs> so, well done. <laughs> Okay, I also was not paying attention to the rules, so how does this work exactly? <laughs> you just walk onto a tile and press A. Oh, okay. It's not too complicated. Okay. A. There we go. Heel. Click Clock's Beaver's really dumb. What's the problem? That makes him glum. Oh, I know. Uh, he can't get in his house. Yeah, easy. <laughs> I golf clap for you. Thank you. <laughs> oh yeah, we actually, okay, so the people don't know, we got all the audio issues fixed. Thanks to Sam, thank you very much. And yeah. what I just realized is we actually have to have them fixed for this episode because we're gonna get, or I'm gonna get asked about sounds and music. <laughs> you are, yeah. Oh, let's see, let's see the picture. Oh, that's, uh, that's the, that should be, like, the pirate level, right? No. No. Mumbo's Mountain? Nope. Okay, well, there's only one left. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. That's next to that, um, pyramid that rises up. It's looking up toward the sky. Oh, it looked like wood, so I didn't, I thought it was maybe the ship. Man, you really do know this game well. Um, I've played textures, this game man. a lot. <laughs> yeah, textures. Does it matter which way I go? No. Um, okay. There's a variety of different options. Some paths have more skulls. The shorter paths have more skulls. The skulls kill you if you get the question wrong. Oh, jeez. <laughs> mm. uh, what was in his blowhole? It was a giant bolt. Yeah, I'm going to try not to... to, to <laughs> Give you all the answers. Okay. <laughs> and I'll help you out. Question on the sound I play. Get it wrong to make my day. Okay, this is the song. <laughs> or sound. Oh, that's easy. <laughs> Gobi's Valley, not Gobi's Peak. <laughs> Gobi's Peak. No, not Gobi's Peak. <laughs> Everyone that views me. Joker card on the left lets you skip a tile. By the way, oh. if you get the question right, it gives that thing two. All right, let's try that. Quick Blackwood, he's the king. What's the squirrel doing in spring? Looking for acorns. He's not looking for acorns. The squirrel? Yeah. Oh! In spring. Yeah. He's eating his nuts. Yeah. I didn't know that. 
I mean, I knew that. <laughs> this is the area, this is like the speedrun trick where you jump off, right? <laughs> yeah, there's there's a one pixel wide gap that you can um, get onto Kazooie with. And then you can just walk along the tiles. Oh, you can. Well, you, you, can... you die, but because you're on Kazooie, you just take a damage instead for some reason. Oh. See, I can't and it removes use all the collision. That's yeah, weird. there's that one pixel gap between tiles that lets oh. you use it. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm not going to do it, but... <laughs> <laughs> Here's a character from the game! Do you know the dumb thing's name? Gobi. Wow, a lot of Gobi stuff. He's a popular guy. <laughs> oh, that's not nice. So His name's I... not Dimbo. <laughs> I've never played Banjo-Tooie, so when he says, I'm going to the lava level, does he actually... Go there in Banjo Tooie. <laughs> yeah, so the original Banjo Kazooie was intended to have, I think, 16 worlds. Um, and they kind of whittled it down to just 10 or 9. Oh, okay. um, but there is a lot of leftover worlds that they just put into Banjo Tooie. And uh, <laughs> Hailfire Peaks is, is one of them. Oh, that's the worst uh... minigame you could have gotten. So you actually do find him, and he's like, I've been waiting two years. Where were you? <laughs> That's pretty funny. You can also get the shoes in the back. That'll make oh, it faster. Yes. That is helpful. Whoa, what? It oh, changes. It's the third minigame. Supposed to only eat the red ones, right? With this one, it changes every five seconds. <sighs> oh. I'm probably going to lose. I messed up twice. Oh, come on. I was like... Right, <laughs> right on. You want no! to rebel again? Yep. <laughs> Dude. This is this is actually like the worst mini though. <laughs> Look at how slow he's going. Yeah, he he's has gorged himself and he is too fat to move. No. It's like right when it changes. It's... The worst part is, is it doesn't even count. Like it doesn't add to your number yeah. if you hit the wrong one. The shoes do help though, a lot. The shoes help a lot, yeah. Oh, well, I so, just lose the health, right? <laughs> yeah. Now, on the skull tiles, it will kill you. Oh, I have to try again. Oh, dang. That is a tragedy. <laughs> oh. Oh, that one was okay. Good thing we're not speedrunning. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to do better this time, don't worry. The other timed mini game, mini games that you can get is, like, um, doing that puzzle in Treasure Trove Cove on the floor. In the sandcastle, oh, that um, but you have to spell me. it backwards. Or there's um, that tile flipping mini game that's in Gobi's Valley. Is another one. Oh, see, that? yeah, those are fine. Oops. Yeah, like this is the worst mini game that you could have gotten. What? What? My cat desires attention. She's like a stream invader. She tries to stream snipe me. Oh, and now she's on my lap. I like cats. Yeah, my wife found this one in a rainstorm outside my house. Caught oh, together. wow. So now I have it. And she loves me better, and it's funny. Adoption. <laughs> All right. There we go. Look at my build. Muscles hot. What's my most enjoyable sport? That does not rhyme. Yeah, yeah. what? Oh! No, these are Brentilda's. Yeah, it's whatever uh, you wrote down. Oh, crap. I don't know if I got that right. I didn't have time to look. Oh, oh you sweet. did! <laughs> With the speed run, anytime that we would use those tiles, we just spam through it and hope that we get it right. <laughs> well, you would have this time because it was the first option. But this is a skull one. How do I use the Joker card? Press B. Or maybe X? It. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Okay, this is a. Uh, I, I gotta look at my paper for this one. <laughs> Bad Hag Monthly. Bad Hag Monthly. Let me cover shot. Uh. That one. Yeah. Yeah! I think I actually saw Again, you do that one. 
You saw me do it. Oh, yeah, I, I did. I think so. I think yeah. that was one that you're like, why am I talking to this woman? <laughs> Uh, okay. Wasn't sure if going to the right would maybe have been shorter there, but... Oh. I wasn't paying attention. That should be a uh, clock wood. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I just We're getting a bunch of Gobi's Valley and Click Clock Wood. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I guess they're pretty equal, actually. And there's more skulls over there. <laughs> There is, yeah, there's two skulls you have to get through. If you take the right side of the path, there's a straight line of three of them. Oh my gosh. Oh, jeez. Yeah, no. I'm just gonna be proposed. Where do I get my delightful clothes? Oh, crap. Uh, this one. I like that the trash can is an option. <laughs> I'm actually not Wait, looking at my paper. Clothes. I just remember writing them down. See, that's why you take notes in school, kids. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Character has its... Honestly, though, like taking notes did help me a lot in school. Uh... Cranky Kong. Oh, crap. <laughs> yeah. There's only one actual character. Oh yeah, so. there is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Clanker's voice yeah, is yeah, the only one that's like yeah. that too. This is another time. If you have gold feathers, make it now. Maybe? I don't remember if I do. I guess when you start the game, should they? Yeah, there we go. They do not refill when you restart the game, actually. Okay. But it, pretty much everything else does. Just your health and your lives, actually. Oh, health and lives, okay. But you now have all your health, which is good. You, uh, you really needed it. <laughs> There was some close calls there that I'm seeing. <laughs> yeah, there was. What does Clanker do? I'm gonna say garbage grinder. I think that's what he does. It's the only thing you don't think really he's a tour guide? <laughs> I am gonna assume. Oh, that's like the hub world, basically. No. No. Yeah, so Mad Monster Mansion is the only other thing. Yeah, it's the it. organ. <laughs> that's like the yeah, top of the pipe organ. Thought. Okay. Alright, let's see. I'm not pretty. I'm quite a mess. What do I hide under my dress? Uh. I believe it's a Cthulhu. <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> She's like Ursula from um, The Little Mermaid. <laughs> See, that doesn't seem worth it if you go all the way to the... Well, I guess there's two more... There's two more skulls, so you could skip that one death tile. Hopefully you successfully get the Joker card. And then go to the uh, next. I'm just gonna keep going. Please stand is where I've been. What's my favorite magazine? Uh, Fat Hag Monthly. <laughs> Which she was featured on the cover of, sitting yeah. on her broomstick. Yeah, and she mentioned that in a previous question. So. Yeah. <laughs> no problem, make your choice. Which character has this dumb voice? Oh, it's the mole. That's easy. This is not easy for Matt because he hasn't heard any of this stuff. <laughs> oh, bottles. Yeah, I grew up playing this game, or watching somebody play this game. <laughs> so I, I've I've heard these sounds since I was like three. And there it is, the matching mini game. Okay. Time is really tight too. Oh really? Yeah. Hopefully you remember them. Oh, no, music notes. Egg. Jinjo. Jinjo. Another Jinjo. Get out of here! Oh my Let me. gosh, that's annoying. You can kill the mummy with a gold feather. Oh. Yeah, that's how you do it. Feather. Oh my feather. gosh, I forgot there's... Feather, hey! <laughs> Kazooie! That was a music note. That's Banjo. Dang it. Hey, look at that! Hey, another Banjo. Music note right next to Banjo. 
happy. I am fine with helping on this. <laughs> Uh, yeah, down there. Other Kazooie was near the corner. Yeah, it's straight across there. Right there. Uh, I think Mumbo is in the top left corner. Oh, uh, okay. I don't remember which one he the is. The other egg was next to the corner. Not in the corner, but... Yeah. Yeah. Run, run, run! Yeah! One <laughs> that was really close. <laughs> Oh, we got it! <laughs> First try! <laughs> Kevin Whale needed air. Mm -hmm. What did you swim through way down there? Um, a large key. How would one swim through the sound barrier? <laughs> <laughs> well, Kazooie can swim pretty fast, I guess. <laughs> I guess! <laughs> Rusty Bay, you may have been, but what on the walls isn't seen? Oh, seven, right? I'm gonna say seven. Yes. <laughs> yeah. There was, yeah, they were all even numbers, I remember. I think there's a total nine. Quite oh, okay. But I think it's all, or uh, it might be 11 actually, but it's, it's unnecessary. Ooh. That one I remember as well. And you can skip this and... last one. Okay. Go <laughs> Or do it. Which tall object solves this riddle? Juju? Yeah. yeah. Okay, we did it! Look at you, and you're getting an achievement! Yeah! Who's master? No one can win, I was assured, by makers of this board. It's not fair, I want to win! How I longed to be real thin. Now you can take the prize on show, while up the winding stairs I go. You won't catch me, I've made sure. All the credits you'll now endure. <laughs> it is it is a long series of credits. I think you have a better grunty <laughs> voice. <laughs> Which prize shall we take, Kazooie? Grotty, ugly thing. I think we should take Tootie. <laughs> That's what I meant. Kazooie. <laughs> Please, can we go home now, Banjo? I've had enough adventuring for one day. Sure, let's get out of this dump. This is all really supposed to take place over the course of one day. <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Mad Monster Mansion is at night. Maybe it's two days. And actually, I think I have, I've been playing for like 10 or 11 hours in my file, so. Yeah. <laughs> it could be one day. Isn't it great to watch this cutscene? <laughs> if only there was something we could do. There might be. Yeah, this might be a good time to bring in, I don't know, something like uh, Verse of the Day, maybe? Woo! Ooh. Verse of the Day. Verse of the Day. And, you know, I was actually gonna make a bit of a joke about how like uh th there there was something that sounded a bit jesus-like in the midst of that <laughs> or at least our conversation and speaking of jesus uh i'm gonna be reading something from acts chapter 13 that talks about him awesome uh so this is uh acts 13 i'm gonna just read 38 and 39 uh so it starts off saying Therefore, my friends, I want you to know that through Jesus, the forgiveness of sins is proclaimed to you. Through him, everyone who believes is set free from every sin, a justification you were not able to obtain under the law of Moses. And that's the end of the passage. Nice. But, yeah, like, it's a real important thing to note this, like, shift in our relationship with God, because as it clearly states here, this was not available before Jesus's death and resurrection. Right, yeah. And so like, that that's really the big shift between Old and New Testament. Um, I think we kind of 
talked about it this way a bit in a previous episode where it's almost more like, you know, old and new covenant because of the massive difference in how we relate with God and it, how sins are forgiven as it mentions here and that it really does all just hinge on Jesus. Yeah. We don't have to sacrifice animals anymore. Specifically right. because he was the ultimate sacrifice. Right, yeah. Yeah, it, it, it was a... Almost... It, it wasn't even really a change in law, though, because, like, when when you would sacrifice an animal to um, have your sins forgiven, it was a particular animal for a particular thing, and it was actually that you were passing on that sin to that animal and then killing it. Ah. And sacrificing it, putting it on the altar, all the special stuff. Thus, when Jesus came, yeah. he was the perfect sacrifice. He was that perfect atonement for our sins. Which is why there's no longer the, I have to go burn a dove because I lied today. Or whatever it was. I don't, actually, I'm not a <laughs> Jewish scholar of any kind, but... And I do know that that's where the term scapegoat comes from. Because <laughs> you blame it all on the goat. But in, like, yeah, like you said, Jewish law, you actually would sacrifice the goat. For, yeah, I don't know what scene, like you said. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's your your, you, you, it, the idea was literally to impart your sin upon the animal being sacrificed, and then kill off the sin right. with the animal. Yeah. yeah, which now that I think about it, makes more sense when they say, like, choosing sin is choosing death because that's what they would do. like. I guess if you were Jewish, that's kind of what you would imagine is like, oh. The sin, we kill the sin. So, if you put it on the animal, and or if you choose sin, then you're basically choosing death. And, and the wages of sin are death. And what? Sorry. The wages of sin are oh, death. Oh yes, yes, exactly. Yeah. Didn't we see this one already? There's more credits <laughs> okay. in the uh, Xbox version because there was more people that worked on it. Oh, okay. Seems I think like we're actually in the original ones now. the characters, but bringing up different credits each time yeah. around. So the original cast on the N64, they all have um, nicknames. So if you look, like it's uh, Kyren Konga, whatever the last name was, I didn't read it. Um, because every single person who worked on the, the original game all got one of the characters in their name as their oh, nickname. Cool. That's how you can differentiate the new ones from the old ones. Interesting. Helpful ideas. <laughs> I want that job. <laughs> big cheese. Phil Spencer, the big man. There she is. Brentilda. She's the only nice witch. <laughs> Matt, you did that hippo's voice, by the way, <laughs> way back then. Yeah. Good job. There were there were only a couple of voices that I wound up doing <laughs> during the game. Well, yeah, because you said you couldn't even read it very well. <laughs> so like, I, I, I think maybe it was a bit delayed on my end, or it would occasionally just kind of lag a little bit. <laughs> Oops. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, we may have to go with this setup moving forward because this seems, you know, noticeably cleaner and like yeah. less laggy. Yeah, I'm I'm particularly fond of this method. Yeah, we're using Skype, by the way. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> 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 we're using Discord. <laughs> is Skype even still a thing? Do people I think still it use is. that? Yes, Skype is still a thing. Yeah. I do video calls with my family about every month or so <laughs> on Skype. That on was, Skype. Skype was like the app back in the day. Like I used it for up until like 2013 probably <laughs> with my friends. Well, it was like the first of its kind. Yeah. Now everything has that. Like even First like big Facebook. one anyway. Yeah. The first one that you probably weren't going to get terrible, terrible computer diseases. <laughs> And then Microsoft bought it and killed it. <laughs> Microsoft is good at that. Yeah. 
Yeah, I mean, they own this property and have done nothing with it besides nuts and bolts, which was, in my opinion, not fun. <laughs> my so, humble opinion. I encourage you to take a look at it again, but not look at it as a Banjo Kazooie game. Okay. And look at it closer to Minecraft. Um, oh, interesting. I have had a lot of fun playing that game. Not treating it at all like a Banjo Kazooie game because it's nothing like any other Banjo Kazooie game. Yeah. But I... kind of like um, Tears of the Kingdom, the new Zelda game, okay. it did the exact same thing because the world is so big that it's not that much fun to explore it on foot or even on horseback. You know, I. Okay, I was going to ask you, what do you think of ukulele? Ukulele? Yeah. I liked it a lot. I. It was not at all a replacement for Banjo Kazooie, it was not an okay. upgraded version. Um, it was similar to Banjo-Tooie. The worlds were really, really big. There was a lot of collectibles. Um, yeah. I did like the expanding worlds idea, where um, you would you would enter the world once, and then after collecting enough pages to complete the world, you would actually leave the world, upgrade it, and return to the world, and it would be an expanded world. I do think that was an interesting idea, but something that Rareware has done a lot of, and now, I guess, uh, Platonic Games does the same thing, they... Um, they focus on a, a mechanic or a gimmick and build the game around that, and I don't think that it was necessarily something that should have been that way. I, I think see. if they had done something on a smaller scale, it would have been better. But because of how large the worlds ended up being, like, I would just get lost. There's some worlds where I don't even... I never completed the game 100% because I can't find everything. Interesting. Alright, credits are done. So that would not be a good game for me to play on the show because I would get <laughs> extremely confused. The worlds are too big. For sure. <laughs> All right. Well, should we call it an episode and do the final fight in the last and another one? Probably. I mean, if the fight is all that's left, then yeah, we're probably better off saving that for another episode. <laughs> it is the fight could be a long left. fight. So, okay. Thank you all very much for watching. Join us next time. Sam will be here again. And. Yep criticizing my every move <laughs> oh yes no, absolutely <laughs> and uh yeah hope you have a good day see you next time bye everybody bye bye <laughs>